Y'all not finna jump her, and y'all not finna tag team nothing. Sour. It's ASMR, you need to be quiet. We're gonna be trying the new chamoy pickle. Hey! Give me the chamoy. So we have a cup because we gotta pour the juice in the cup. Oh my god. Oh my god, let me get a bite. What do we do now? Eat it. Do I just bite it? Girl, what the? <laughs> Slow down, dang. Stop. What do you want? I just want a little bite. No, please. you can't have any. It's all for me. That's it. She's grounded. I'm trying to be. I'm done. Cut the cameras. Oh, God. Are you okay? She's okay. She's still breathing. Hey y'all, so this morning I woke Tiana up so gently and then I made her favorite breakfast in the world, Cheerios and a side of greens. Mama, you only gave me like five Cheerios. Are you serious? I think she loved it. Then I caught this girl texting a new guy named DJ. Who the heck is DJ? So I made her write, I will not text DJ at least 10 times on the paper. 
Oh my god, my hand hurts. I'm tired of writing this over and over. I don't care. Keep writing. Then it was time for laundry. I had to wash some of Tiana's clothes because we had to get ready for the week. It was a nice day, so I took Tiana and Blue to the park so we could have a nice little family outing. They just look like they're having so much fun together. I just love spending quality time with my family. Perfect. Then we made a YouTube video. Say I'm a good mom. Yes, ma'am.
I think we have a problem. This is gonna be really bad. Ow! Oh my god. I didn't think she would survive. <laughs> this is so cool. Even got a bald spot, ridges, the wig cap, it got everything. Oh my god. Oh my god. Jump gear. <laughs> Okay, so let me tell you the story about how I literally ruined Christmas because I really thought I was doing a good deed, but I really did not. I ruined it. So Tiana came in my salon asking for her box braids, but I was like, baby, no. Baby, no, we can't do box braids because I don't got the time for box braids. I got to get home to my kids, my children. So I decided to give her a bob. And, you know, I thought I was doing a good deed because I was giving it to her for free because she said she didn't have no money. So I was like, you know what? It's fine. So at this point, I thought I ate. I was like, wow, look at me doing good things for the community. No. OK, so at this point, I really thought I was eating. I was curling it. I was cutting it. I'm giving it layers. I'm giving it dimension. I'm giving it body, everything that it needs. And then I look up. <laughs> What is this? Like, it's literally giving a bowl cut. I tried to serve her with the cute little half up, half down hairstyle, but it was just giving the little Cindy Lou girl from the Grinch. Then it's just giving coconut head. Her mom's gonna kill me, so R.I.P. Tiana came in my salon looking a little raggedy, so I had to clean my girl up. So I don't know if y'all know, but I'm an as I am girly now, and their products have me hooked. So it's only right that I give my clients the same products that I use in my hair. Tiana's hair was looking very dry and very brittle, so we had to put that moisture all the way back in. She told me that she wanted an updo, so that's exactly what we gave her. She was definitely serving princess vibes. Now she could look fresh as a daisy every single day because these products are at your local drugstore.
The biggest mistake I ever made was trusting my own daughter to do my makeup. I know exactly what you're about to ask me, Drea. Why would you ever let Tiana do your makeup? You know she's crazy. She's demented. She needs psychological help. I know. I know. But I was just trying to have a good mother-daughter moment. I thought we really needed this to better our relationship. <laughs> So I'm just trying to guide her like a loving mother would do, right? I almost got beat unconscious with my own makeup brushes. My makeup brushes that I bought with my money. Like who does that? A crazy demented person and y'all think I'm the problem. I'm the victim. Not only did I reach out to Dr. Phil once, but twice. This is my second cry for help. At this point, this was my last straw. I'm packing her bags as we speak. I'm throwing her stuff into trash bags and I'm dropping it off at the curb. So whoever wants to come pick her up, just type in the comments and let me know was that really necessary what do you get out of this it's really me just sitting there letting her do my makeup thinking that it was gonna come out cute after all of this happened and that was my final straw that was my final straw The biggest mistake I ever made in my life was trusting my own daughter to do my hair. I felt like I was being jumped, whooped, and attacked. And I thought this was going to be a really cute mother-daughter moment for us. I was wrong. I'm going to be real with y'all. After this, 
This girl has a one way ticket to boarding school or jail. Whichever one suits her the best. I don't know, y'all. I give up. I give up on this gentle parenting thing. It's just not for me. I'm going to have to call Dr. Phil because we need an intervention. And to be honest, I'm not even a tender headed person. Like, this was like pure torture. Death. Not going to lie. At this point, I was just ready to cut the cameras. But you know what? I wanted to show a real authentic day in my life. Y'all really be thinking that, oh, she's torturing her daughter. But the truth is, I'm fighting for my life every single day. I'm the victim. And sure enough, I was in for a surprise. You would have thought that I was going to come out looking like a baddie after all of that torture. To all the ladies that want to be mothers, just do yourself a favor and just don't. Don't do it. It's not worth it. Anyway, always remember to be blessed. Love you. I just want you to brace yourself. <laughs> Clearly homegirl has been through some things, but look, I don't judge. I don't judge. <laughs> she has a lot of breakage. I honestly don't even know what could happen to cause this, but we're going to take care of it. All right. So the hair that we're using today, I got from East Africa myself. <laughs> Thank you very much. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. You know, I'm coming with the heat. <laughs> so I'm trying to style as I go because I got plans tonight. I'm about to go out and kick it with the girls. To be completely candid with you, I know it's the beginning of the month, but I'm going to close my books, even though this is the only appointment I had. It's just stressed me out. I just think I need to go on a vacation to Turks and Kinkles. <laughs> And if you're mad, stay mad. Like, what do you want me to do about it? <laughs> so the vibes of today is giving aquamarine with a little bit of storm because I don't know, these colors, they just speak to me. I pop some rollers in her hair and we gonna give her a little Brazilian blowout vibe. It's giving. Oh my God. As always, remember to be blessed. Love you.
let me tell y'all something besties the enemies are in the house with you i got woken up to be jumped whooped dragged and attacked by my own kinfolk my own blood now i know exactly what you guys are thinking drea you deserve everything that is coming to you no i don't and i caught them conspiring against me so i was trying to get my mind off of everything trying to do a haul for the girls and i just felt so unsafe in my own home like what did i do to deserve this then i was met with ice cubes in my underwear as if getting my whooped wasn't enough so buki has said sorry for everything and then he said he was gonna make me some dinner but when i took a look I was disgusted. What is that? What is that? Like, I just couldn't bring myself to eat it. And then he forced me to eat it. And then I had the bubble guts. And Tiana's trying to beat my ass down the hallway. And I'm trying to get to the toilet before I myself. I got two words for y'all. Bubble guts. When I tell y'all I was fighting for my life on that toilet, I'm not playing. And then they tried to break in the bathroom and laugh at me and make fun of me. I guess I could say that I lost this battle. Defeated. Oh, oh jump scare.
Let me ask you a question. Do you know what season it is? It's baddie season! Ah! So you already know I'm about to be doing the best of the best quick weaves, the best of the best silk presses, the best of the best lace fronts, period, point blank. Don't ask me no other questions. <laughs> My client of the day is Tiana, and you already know she wants some type of extravagant hairstyle. And guess what? She don't got extravagant hairstyle money. So we're going to give her a quick weave with this hair that I got from the beauty supply. Thank you very much. And just because it's a quick weave does not mean that it's not going to eat. It's going to eat regardless. I'm not going to lie, Tiana was looking like one of those dogs with the luxurious hair. This one right here. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Tiana was low-key complaining this whole entire time. So you know what I did? I gave her a Karen haircut. Yes, I did. <laughs> She's in her Karen era. Since she wants to complain about everything all the time, she could complain while looking the part. Thank you very much. It's giving, can I speak to your manager? <laughs> Her mama is about to eat me up for this one, but I don't even care. This is the finished look. It's eating. It's giving. Bye. Just so y'all don't get it twisted, and I never want y'all to forget that all of my wigs are Malaysian, Brazilian, Indian, Peruvian, over the sea, under the sea, hair, HD, invisible lace. Don't ask me no questions, period, point blank. Thank you. And this is exactly why I hate doing little kids hair, because y'all always moving around too much. I'm going to need for some of y'all parents to step it up because at this point I'm raising a community here. So today we're giving my girls some beach waves, mermaid hair, whatever you want to call it because it's baddie season. So you already know we had to spray it down with some got to be glue. <laughs> why does my hand look like that? Like no, for real, for real, why does my hand look like that? Oh my god, somebody cut the cameras. I'm not gonna lie y'all, when I was doing her hair, it was fried. It was fried. I'm just gonna admit it. I'm not even gonna tell no lies. Just listen for yourself, honestly. But it came out super cute. Look at the middle piece where I fried it. It's literally melted off. <laughs> okay, not me casually dying, but let me tell you, she ate. Literally eating the girls up, period. <laughs>
jump gear. This morning I was sleeping so peacefully when I felt like I was being jumped, attacked. I was legit fighting for my life. Uh. And this is a scene of me casually having a mental breakdown. Enjoy. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. This was some paranormal activity right here. So I started doing my makeup because I'm like, if I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die a baddie, period. <laughs> so I was trying to get my mind off of things by cleaning and I just felt like somebody was watching me. Like I just kept feeling eyes on me. It's like I can feel her presence everywhere. It felt like somebody was breathing down my neck. No, but for real, I felt like I was tweaking out. Like I swear to God, I was saying double, triple. But then I was thinking to myself, maybe if I do something nice for her, then she'll stop torturing me i don't understand what i did to deserve all of this like i treat her with the utmost respect always but little did i know she had another thing coming for me she switched our bowls and i ended up eating that sh like what the this is literally me crying throwing up on the floor like but one thing about me i ain't no b and i i killed that bye all right ladies listen up i'm about to show you how to keep a man 101 today i'm being a good housewife and a mother and i'm baking brownies for the family Purr. and before you ask yes i had to crack the eggs on her head because i had no other surface do with this information what you will i don't know <laughs> If your man leaves you for this recipe, I'm not responsible. And I know it looks like a lot of crazy things, but like you have to trust the process. Once you mix it all together and bake it with that heat, it's going to make sense. And these are all the ingredients I use just in case you want to be like me. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to me. Keep the kids out the kitchen. Keep the kids out the kitchen. Yeah, we got into a little squabble or whatever, but it was cool. Honestly, I'm so happy that it happened because if it didn't, I wouldn't have those two little pieces of weave to add into the mix. <laughs> this was the solution to all my problems. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is why we can never have nice things in this family. I'm trying so hard to make this family vlog channel work, but it's just not for me. Uh, okay, don't come for me. Don't come for me. I couldn't find my knife, so I had to use a pizza cutter. <laughs> Honestly, if you have a man, you should really take some notes because this is how you keep a man, ladies, period. <laughs> I just want you to prepare yourself. Oh, oh jump scare. <laughs> Rip me out the plastic. I'm not gonna lie, I felt a little bad about bleaching my daughter's hair and making it all fall out as a prank. That wasn't right, that wasn't right at all. Um, but it was a little funny though. You can't even lie. <laughs> my girl said she wanted to look like Ice Spice, so I'm going to deliver. At this point, I'm tired of my hairstylist playing in my child's hair and making me waste eight thousand dollars every single time I want her to get a lace front. Ashley, count your days. I'm pulling up. She be saying, oh, it's Malaysian, it's Peruvian, it's over the sea, it's under the sea, it's planetarium hair. Then she claims that it's shed free hair. Shed free wear because this wig is shedding more than my dog at this point. I'm not even going to lie. This was a lot of work. I can't be doing this every other month. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. I really thought I was about to mess this wig up, but it low-key ate her. She a baddie. She's showing her panties. She's shaking like jelly, but I'm still throwing it in the deli. Ah! Bye. Hey y'all, so my client of the day is Tiana, and honestly, what other clients do I really have? None. Anyway, so she wanted a balayage, and honestly, her hair was already looking messed up, so it really wasn't much I could do to it. <laughs> that was me having a snack break. <laughs> to be honest, I really wasn't feeling the vibe, so I told her that she had to wait for 30 minutes, so I left. I took my dog for a walk around the neighborhood, and then I went to Sally's because I forgot the bleach powder to mix in with the developer, and then me and my man went to go get some tacos, and I offered her some, but she really didn't want none. She was a little mad at me because I took too long. Apparently, she said she fainted from the smell of chemicals and it smelled like burning plastic and that's the last thing she remembered when it came out she was passed out cold on the floor anyway i had to start all over because we forgot the bleach powder so this process took way too long and so i tried to use the blow dryer to speed up the process but her hair ended up catching on fire and um yeah it melted her hair literally came out in chunks i'm not gonna lie it was really funny though <laughs> 
to be honest, at this point, there was really nothing much I could do besides rip out her hair from the root. I low-key cried about it because I knew her mama was gonna kill me, but that's the risk that you have to take when you're a hairstylist. As always, remember to be blessed. Love you. If you thought that this was gonna be a cute day in the life, you're wrong. So today I felt so generous and wanted to do something nice for my daughter Tiana and decided to take her to her favorite restaurant in the world, McDonald's. Ah! But that ended shortly because she fell out of the car. Tiana, I told you to sit in the car and keep on a seatbelt. A broken collarbone ain't never hurt nobody. <laughs> Mama, can I please get my Smarty Pants vitamins, please? Tiana, I got you McDonald's and I got you an ice cream cone. And you want Smarty Pants vitamins? Here, have at it. Have a blast. I can't believe I have to take this little gremlin with me everywhere I go in public. I devoured my food. Can I get my ice cream cone, please? Oh my God, Tiana, here. Oh my God. I like to live by my life motto. I'm not a regular mom. I'm a cool mom. And if you live by that motto, you could be just like me someday. Bye. Get ready with us for Tiana's first day of school, purr! Tiana's so excited about starting middle school and I had to make sure that my girl slayed all day and didn't stink so we sprayed her with a little perfume and now we're gonna give her wig a little retouch. My girl says she wanted a little silk press so that's exactly what we're about to do. Okay, cause this wig is definitely eating, it's giving Barbie, it's giving everything that it needs to give, purr! Oh my god, not me having lotion on my face and I didn't even realize anyway, child. Alright, so now it's time to eat breakfast and I'm making Tiana her favorite protein shake because she don't like eating nothing else. This is a concoction straight from the kitchen, straight from the gutter. I just love doing nice things for my children. It absolutely warms my heart and just makes me feel like the best mom in the world. <laughs> you should strive to be like me, honestly. And now we're making her bloom because she cannot leave the house without her bloom. And now it's time to take pictures because if you're not taking pictures of your kid on the first day of school what are you doing as always remember to be blessed love you no because it's ridiculous don't point your finger at me don't you dare try to make my child look like that don't you dare call maddie b go to hell go to hell your kid would rather be with any mother here than with i'm not gonna stand here and let you talk to my child like that everybody else here will but i will not i'm so sick of this tiana let's go he's a f Drag it in here. No, you go to hell, there. Hey! Stop! Oh, please. Who wants to hear your mouth? Kathy, you're finished. You're washed up. You're oh, old. You're I? nothing. Oh, really? Get on the broom and fly oh, away. I? I don't need to get on the broom and fly away. Don't touch other I'm people. Not touching you. You sat in the theater and you I poked me on, you on the, the back. back and I told you to shut your mouth because all you don't do touch other people is talk through other kids' dances. You're a hypocrite. And you're a joke in the dance community. How am I oh, a joke? yes you oh, are. Oh no, doll. I've got news for you. You know what's red, you know white, what? and black Listen, all over? The obituary. You know what? And that's where you, you know belong. What? No, honey. You would know about an obituary. You would know. Beautiful. Beautiful. Point your toes, Bethany. Chest up. Chin up. Oh, wow. That's fine. If you want to replace Tiana with Bethany, go ahead. We're done here. Tiana, is your mother speaking for you? Um, Do you not want to dance? Oh I don't need to see Tiana, cut it. You're 10 years old. Girl, the hell up. You shut the hell up. You guys see how she talks to me? Please. Oh, Gabby, please. I've had enough. You're a bully like for a teacher. Sir. Here's your costume. Enjoy the dance. I mean, clearly, she wants someone who's never danced here to take Tiana's place. No, I didn't, Ding Bat. Listen. Get your finger out of my face. I'm calling the police. That's it. You're done. I guess I would like to file a police report. She's like a 500 pound hog pretending to eat my face. Tiano, your rib cage is open. Close it in. Point your toe. Your shoulders are hunched. Bring it back. Cut, cut, cut. Tiana, to the sidelines. Now. Tiana, your solo was good, but it wasn't great. You could have done better. Bethany is getting your solo position. You do not deserve to be in a solo position at all. Gabby, that is absolutely ridiculous. She does not deserve this. She deserves nothing. What more do you want from her? She is giving you everything. Oh my God. What is happening right now? Uh, no, 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 no. That's what we're not 
gonna do? I don't have time for crying children. I wouldn't be crying if you wasn't yelling at me. You're a mean, mean, mean mother. That's it. Get out. I'm not gonna deal with you and your raggedy mother. Get out of my studio. Don't want you coming back here. Stop filming us. Tiana, let me try one of your Takis. No, mama, you already banged your chips up. Oh, please, Tiana, just give me one Takis. Stop being stingy. I didn't even wash my hands. They smell like booty chips up. Tiana Marie Williams, if you do not give me a Takis, I'm going to take the bag myself. Oh, I'm fine. Here. Thank you. Happy Fourth, everyone. I'm feeling very patriotic. This is perfect for the fireworks. Here, Tiana. Oh my God. Oh my God, hi, Mima. Hey, Papa. Tiana, say hi to your Mima and your Papa. Hey. Mom, can I please go on the Ferris wheel with Jemaya, Lamaya, and Kamaya? If you're gonna go to the carnival and ride on the rides, then you need to stay with your cousins. Bethany, wait for me. Do not wander yes, off. Yes, ma'am, or whatever. It is so hot. They chose the absolute worst day of the year to have the 4th of July. Thanks a lot, George Washington. Oh, say. Come on, sing it with me, Tiana. Does that star spangle? Can I get a slushy, please? Why would I buy you a slushy if I brought waters from home? Drink up. Does anybody know when the fireworks start? Tiana, stop sitting over here looking like a ghost and go get me some churros. Excuse you. You're blocking my view. You're like 6'4". Move out the way. Oh my God, Tiana. What happened to you? Ashley was supposed to give me a bob. This calls for an emergency appointment. An emergency? Louisa, Louisa, get the girls. It's an emergency. But first, I got to drink my bloom. Do you want some? No, thank no? you. Okay. More for me. <laughs> Dang, I'm oh sorry, God. sweetheart. The scissors is not working. We're gonna have to take extreme measures. Extreme measures? What the? We're just gonna have to rip it off. Just brace yourself. Oh my God. Louisa, I'm gonna need your assistance. Louisa, you ripping off okay, my hair. Okay, just be gentle. What is She's happening? She's a child. Right? Oh, oh my God. God, Louisa, I told you to be gentle. Cut the cameras. We're gonna get you together, Tiana. I promise. Don't you worry about a thing. Don't worry about a thing. <sighs> I didn't think I could do it, but we got it together. So we took this and this and we gave you oh a my princess. God. Hey y'all, so my client of the day is Miss Little Tiana. As you all know, she is a handful and I wish I never met her. That's besides the point though. She said she wanted a bob and a bob is what she's gonna get. And not to mention, she ruined my comb. As you can see here, the bob is not bobbing. We cut the first little layer and the bob is not <laughs> bobbing, baby. What are we gonna do? So I decided to take a leap of faith and I kept cutting because I had no other option. Before this girl calls her mama up here and she gonna whoop my, ooh, not the smoke. <laughs> not the smoke jesus oh my god so i had to take a little drink break because now your girl is stressed i was going through and bloom it just helps calm my nerves because i got real bad digestive issues oh, jump jump scare. Scare. she told me she wanted to be a little bit more edgy so that's exactly what i gave her and tell me why this little girl got the nerve to get mad at me so i kicked her out of my salon because i am not dealing with that no ma'am i'm not I'm having a fucking panic attack right now. I need to calm the fuck down. Get out! If you thought that this was going to be a cute get ready with me, you're wrong. I had to use the strength of the Lord to get these tangles out because what is this? And y'all already know what it is. We start our mornings off with bloom every single morning. It is like a lifestyle at this point. Tiana wanted some singleese twists for her vacation hairstyle. And I told her, girl, I do not know how to do no singleese twists. All I got to say is, Ashley, count your days because this wig was definitely not tangle free. So I had to resort to this little ugly bun and we were out the door and ready for the day so this morning tiana was acting like she didn't want to get out of bed so i had to make her get out of bed quit moving around too damn much yes ma'am and this is why we can't get nowhere on time because look at this you got a whole track oh my hair god that just fix came it, out. please can y'all believe i took her to the hair salon the other day and i paid for an eight thousand dollar lace front wig and you mean to tell me that these tracks is coming out like this uh-uh, I want my money back. Ashley, count your days. As you can see here, she had a bit of a mustache situation and... <laughs> and these are my favorite facial cleansing wipes. I got them on vacation when I was in Peru. And um, 
<laughs> I have no words. <laughs> so this right here is the most important step before I do Tiana's makeup. I um <laughs> put sunscreen and moisturizer on and Tiana told me she wanted me to beat her face and that's exactly what I did. <laughs> Then I gave her a fresh manicure and some braids and we are out the door and ready for the day. My girl is giving Wendy's. <laughs> okay, breathe in. Hey y'all, so my client of the day is Tiana and she came in my shop without washing her hair and she knows that's a straight violation because she knows I'm gonna charge an extra $350. Thank you very much. And it smelled like <laughs> badussi. So we're giving her a lace front wig today and this hair is really special hair. As you can see, it is Malaysian, Polynesian, Brazilian, Bohemian, Planetarium, Aquarium, Body Wave. It costs about $8,000. All the hair that I get is imported. And if you can't afford it, then you really shouldn't be trying to book an appointment with me because this is medical grade hair. Okay, this hair is definitely giving Little Mermaid, period. The special thing about this hair is that it is tangle free. There is absolutely no tangles, no shedding whatsoever. HD lace, can't see the lace, can't see the glue, like HD transparent, bleached knots, everything, all of that. And then we added some fringe to give it some layers and my girl is definitely giving red hair scissor, period. Mm, these hot cheetos are good mama you gotta try mine it's so good uh, here mama taste this uh, no sweetie i'm good no trust me it's so good uh. tiana it doesn't even look like you washed your hands i washed my hands but there was no soap in the bathroom so i just used toilet water no i'm fine please okay fine in this moment, Drea knew she messed up. See, I told you it was good, mama. It tastes good. Excuse me, please donate to our fundraiser. We out here trying to hustle for the children. Oh, I'm so sorry, sweetie. I actually don't have any cash on me right now. But maybe next time. <laughs> oh, that's no problem at all. We actually take credit. You know, that's crazy. I actually left my credit card in the car and it was so hard for me to find a parking spot. I parked like 200 miles away. <laughs> we actually got you covered. We take cash app. Yeah, you can cash app me at Freaky T123. Ah! Oh, that's too bad. I only use Zelle. I don't have cash app at all. Listen, lady, we're donating for the children. Look at her head. Police! Do you want this child to have box braids or not? Do you want to go another day knowing that there's another child in this community that does not have box braids? How could you Show sleep at compassion. night? compassion. Where's your heart? Okay, okay, fine. Just take all my money. Take all of it. Thank you for supporting the cause. Oh my God. I'm combing your hair as soft as I can. Relax. Yes, ma'am. Oh my God, what did you do? Hello? Girl, not again, oh my God. Girl, like, get it together. What am I supposed Why to do? Well, maybe if every you was a little seconds. more gentle, then my head wouldn't be popping off every five seconds. It looks like it's all your fault. Yes, ma'am. My baby, mm -hmm, you grew whatever. up so fast. Tiana. Shh. I can't wait to get my cap and gown girl, so I can get too. up out of here. Nobody cares. Then, Shh. <laughs> I'm hot. Is anyone else hot? At St. Peter's, we teach our kids the highest education. Does anyone have a fan? I mean the highest. Oh my God, I can't believe we're about to go to middle Shh. school. Ladies, be quiet. Oh, say can you see? Bye. Oh my God, her voice is so angelic. Tiana Williams. Oh my God, that's me. Let's go, Tiana. Thank you so much. Please hold your applause until all names have been called. Oh, please. Pictures, we need pictures. Let's take a picture with Bethany. Bethany. 
Anthony, come over here. Come on, bring it in, girls. Dang, Tiana, you got that green apple bottom in that green Oh, tree. my God. Thank you so much. Louisa, where's my 3 o'clock? She's late. Sorry, there was traffic oh on the God, way. Tiana, what's going on with this new look? I'm in my Ice Spice era. Like, damn, she in her mood. You look so different. So what's new with you? Give me the 411. It's been a lot going on, but I think I'm gonna break up with DJ soon. Isn't that the one boy that you said you didn't like because you thought he was too ugly for you? But he treated you well. He said he thought my mama was fine. See, I told you, you never give an ugly man a chance because once you do, you're gonna wish you never did. What did I tell you? So now I just don't know what to do. I say kick him to the curb. If a man is going to go and flirt with other girls in front of your face, flirt with another guy in front of his face. Oh my God, I think that's what I'm about to do. What about that one boy, Tyrone? Oh my God, you remember Tyrone? Yes, I remember everything, sweetheart. Trust me, the town talks and they all talk to me. Say good morning. Good morning or whatever. Today we're going to take Tiana to dance. My baby, she's a dancer. Um, you forced me to do this. I did not force you to do dance. You wanted to do dance. Tell everyone how you love dance and that this has been your passion for how long. She was born a dancer. She came out of me dancing. <laughs> Just wailing her arms. Ah! Tiana, set up the camera for mommy. You set it up. We're such a happy family. I just want to reiterate that. Tiana wanted me to tell everyone that she did her own hair today. Do you want to tell them how you did it? No, not really, but whatever. Hey, y'all, was popping. So today I did my hair. As you can see, I did two space buns and then I got some rollers from Louisa and the girls. We got the curls in the back. We got the curls on the sides and we got a little bayang. In my outfit of the day, we have a green dress i'm about to get all out here and i'm about to show everybody that i'm a dancer apparently i'm a dancer now like what the mama can i please stop now like i don't even like you for real for real like, i just don't understand um <laughs> kids they say the darnest things 10 minutes we have 10 minutes left and we're going inside bethany wait for me <laughs> no running you need to walk Hey, Tiana. Hey, baby. Tiana and DJ, enough with the flirting. This is not Love Island. This is reset. I don't even know why I signed up for this job. I just want to get through college. That's it. Hey, TT, can I play with y'all? Get away from me. You can't hang with my crew. Tiana, you need to cut it out and be nice. It's about to turn up. I keep on falling. Hair long, money long. Me and broke girls, we don't get along. Hey. One more thing, and you're going to the office. One more thing, Tiana, and I'm not playing. Yes, ma'am, or whatever. Oh, my God, let's go, DJ. Oh, my God. No more resets. Oh, my That's God. That's it. Ms. You should have listened to me when I gave you guys multiple warnings. Let's go. Is that your mom over there? Oh, my Dang, God. She's fine. Mama. Hey, mama. Tiana. Tiana, look. Mommy brought you lunch. I know you had a bad day on your field trip yesterday, but mommy wanted to do something so nice for you. Wow, Got you some fries, oh some chicken nuggets, oh. your sweet and sour sauce, and you have like the cutest little toy ever. And then oh your high God, C, I know you love you that. Thank you so mommy much. Mommy has to go back to work, but I love you so much. Oh, love you too. Bye. Oh my God, I'm really about to eat this up. Baby, can I get a piece since I'm your one and only? No, why would I give you some of my food? Tell your mama to come up here and bring you some. Looks like my parent duties are done for the day.